So, hi everybody, day two of vlogging. I am on my way to Leeds train station. I'm gonna be going to London today. I've got quite a busy day ahead with lots of exciting things which I'm gonna be sharing with you. So I hope you can come along and join me. Cheers. into a black cab. I'm on my way to Wigmore Street to L'Atelier de Chefs where I'm going to be meeting um, TV presenter and um, actress of Cold Feet, Faye Ripley, and we're going to be making some mini roasts. Charlotte. Me too. Looks amazing. Hi. Hello. <laughs> wow, these look like lovely cuts of lamb. Could I have some lamb, please? Yeah, so, yeah, that looks like a good... Have you got an idea of what you're going to do with it? So I'm going to do like a Mediterranean take on the lamb with lots of garlic, um, and some um, rosemary in there. Okay. And I'd love a bit of wine for the jus of the, you've got any nice red wine. Yeah. Just setting up the camera is actually balanced on yeah. some uh, kitchen rolls, as you do. I'm sure this happens on TV all the time when um, celebrity chefs are getting their Nigella on. But essentially I'm gonna be making a um, lamb, uh, roast lamb, something that I do quite a lot for the kids. So I've got my lamb here. Um, I actually tend to um, literally put everything in one tray, so it's a really easy like one tray bake. This is quite a thick piece of, um, of lamb, so um, it's going to need me to get lots of thank you, got the wine, Woo! that's exactly what we need for the jus. It's fine to do that for children because the alcohol evaporates and we're just left with a really delicious juice to it. I am where oh this is um, really similar to what I did um, junior master chef age 11 sorry dad that I made it fourth in the north they didn't quite get me on telly oh well my eyebrow game was not good I wasn't ready for that close-up so now let's see if I can win come on guys so these are my ingredients um, rosemary garlic olive oil new potatoes lovely lovely um, piece of lamb there and um, some gorgeous tomatoes on the vine, salt and pepper. Can you, did you spot the wine as well? And then I am also going to add some water for the jus. This is a really quick, simple and easy dish that can be made within the hour. Hello Becky, this is Becky from English Mum. Hello. Hello darling, so tell me what you've made today then. Uh, kiss kiss with sort of like little again. Wow, delicious. Oh, that would be so flavoursome. Wow. And I've rubbed my lamb with harissa, so it's going to be light, smoky. Oh, gorgeous. Wow, excited. I'm going to try that later. Okay. Thank you. Okay, so darling Charlotte, looking gorgeous in the kitchen. Watch out, Nigella. <laughs> <laughs> Tell me what you've been cooking. Let's see. Okay, so okay, you've already. So this is done. This, this is the is aftermath the of the feast that you've created. See, I am a very messy chef. No, I'm sorry, good. Dad. <laughs> so what have you made? Um, I've made a lamb and a sweet potato and potato rice. Delicious. Can't wait to see it. Yeah. So I'm here with celebrated actress Tina Fey he's got a book where's your book we Wrong need to hold your name who's Tina Fey start again. start again other equally celebrated actress <laughs> so I'm here with Faye Ripley he's got this amazing book Woo! three books 
books. Three books, this is number three. That's number three. So fate makes it easy. What are you making easy for us, babe? Your whole life. <laughs> yes. Basically. There is, uh, you know, through the medium of food, but... Um, Let's go up close uh, so people can see that. Can you see that? Beautiful. There it is. Anyway, Not, right, it's done. basically because I'm a busy working mum and I felt that there wasn't enough out there uh, that was basically going to work. Like there was lots that was inspiring me, but then it depressed me and took my confidence away because oh. I couldn't actually do it. So yeah, too complicated. We are really time short as parents. I've got two time children short. and yeah. it's hard. So give um, us some examples of some of your favorite recipes and how long does it take to rustle up? Within the hour, you would say, most of these. Uh, some of these you can rustle up in 10 minutes. Really? Some of these uh, you might, it, it might be in the oven for an hour, but you're doing your hair. <laughs> <laughs> and you know how much that means to me, oh, viewers. Right, well. <laughs> no, it's so, me. Me. So, ta so which are your top three, would you say? Well, Apologies. somebody in the kitchen today is using tahini, and that is yeah. my absolute favourite ingredient because there is a recipe that I do which you can do in small fillets, uh, and there's great, uh, as often on salmon or trout, there's often get great deals in the supermarket. But I do it as a half a, a, a piece of salmon. Again, you get them really, really cheap, actually. And you smother it and roast it in tahini Delicious. and it comes out and it, it honestly you get a round of applause which as far as I'm concerned <laughs> I want a round of applause for a boiled egg <laughs> let alone a dinner so what are you up to at the moment um, I so am about to start filming a certain series that Thanks. is coming back that, Yay! Um, I'm probably not meant to talk here are um, mine and Charlotte's um, lamb fillets they're cooking and we're just keeping a little eye on so it's just come out of the oven now and um, quite a lot of sauce, possibly that extra bit of water that I popped in was maybe a touch too much. I might now reduce this in a pan. So we've got about five minutes to go before our dishes are going to be judged. Ladies, on this mummy, yeah. <laughs> so, um, I created um, a sort of Mediterranean lamb here with a red wine reduction. Um, I think possibly it was a bit in the oven a bit too long because I was yapping. What a surprise! <laughs> <laughs> uh, I think that's the I think that's the best cooked piece of lamb yeah. oh, on the table in thank terms you. of the slight. It's got a tiny bit of pinkness that won't put off the kids, but it's still tender. Um, <laughs> and I think that might have happened by luck. Um, no, <laughs> no, no culinary <laughs> prowess I'm and skills. <laughs> that's what it is. Because I was, you know, I was filming, tweeting, cooking, okay. eating okay. quite a bit. Okay, but anyway, it no. didn't work out for you. It, it did well, yeah, no. Anyway, it's delicious. delicious. Thank you. Um, delicious, sort of Frenchy mm. flavour to it. Oh, very thank you. Lovely. Um, you feel that's a sort of, you're on holiday, a roast when you're yeah. on holiday. Oh, thank you so much. I think just simple flavours, that's tend to what I, what don't, which don't go wrong usually. Very nice. but For us, um, it was really between two, two, but it's slightly hip to the post, and we would like to say, yes, you are the winner. Well done. You are the winner. Oh, yeah. 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 That's my wine. I'm um, not um, sure you show you <laughs> It's so nice to be on vlogging friends and have like delicious food and we have fun with the challenge and it's just been such a good day, hasn't it? So thanks for having us guys. So I'm here with Dave from Dad Adventurer and his gorgeous little girl. Say hello. Oh, what are you doing? What are you doing? Are you crawling? So we're off for a little walk. We've had a coffee and we are at the British Library. I'm at 
St Pancras, I'm seeing to get on my train. I've had a really, really fab day. It's been really busy, um, but really lovely. Uh, being a blogger is never, ever boring, that's for sure. Um, and um, it's been lovely to hang out with great people, other people that are bloggers too, that get this world that we're all working in and living in and loving, and just people that I really connect with and um, have made today really, really good fun. Can't wait to get home. My little babies will be sleeping. Babies, they're like three and five, always be my babies, but um, I'll be giving them little snuggly kisses while they sleep. Um, it won't be too late, but um, I'll, I'll definitely miss the bedtime. But um, I'll see my little cherubs tomorrow. Thanks guys for following the day. I hope you've enjoyed it as much as I have. Ciao.